Hello and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. I know I haven't posted in a while but honestly I blame school <laughs> and last week I practically did nothing on Monday and was out the other days. I just I needed a break from all the stress so I did nothing and I didn't I didn't feel like making a video. I know that sounds bad but I just need, I needed a break. <laughs> anyway this week I'm back and I actually did this drawing a few weeks ago. Um, I think it was end of June, maybe? Maybe even before that. Um, I know it was a while ago, so. But still not, like, ages ago. Um, that doesn't make much sense. Anyway, I'm not a digital artist. And that sounds stupid because I do loads of digital paintings on YouTube. That is 90% of what I post on here. But most of the art I do... Is actually traditional. I just don't have time to film it. And I wanted to get better at digital art. And I I like semi-realism. So most of my paintings or my drawings. They are realistic to the level where you can tell what it is. And it has the right proportions. But a lot of the time they do have a bit of a cartoony twist. Or they're, they don't, they're not like... I don't know what the word is, super realism, I think it is, when it looks like exactly like the thing it is. I, I don't know if it makes much sense. What I'm saying is, I do realism, but not realism. That made no sense at all. Anyway, <laughs> I love drawing eyes. Um, But I th it was really daunting, the idea of doing it on my phone. Yes, I drew this on my phone. <laughs> I don't have any fancy equipment. I do have a tablet for my laptop, but um, I don't have the right software on there at the moment to use, so I couldn't do anything to thing on there. And I also, I'm not quite sure how to record the drawings I do on my laptop, so that wasn't exactly an option here. Also, I like doodling on my phone because it means that I can do it when I'm out and about, and that just means that I have more time on it and also, I get to make more content for you guys. Anyway, that's not the point. This here is my eye. I, If you were looking, I redid that pupil, that iris, not pupil, that iris, three or four times. I did it so many times. It was a mess. If anyone wants to give me some tips on drawing eyes digitally, please feel free to do so because I am not good at it. I ended up with something decent, which is what you're seeing right now, uh, but it's not the best, and it doesn't have the details, and I wanted to do the details, I, want, I wanted it to look realistic, because I, <laughs> I haven't done any realistic digital paintings before. This is my first one, and I was so happy with how it was turning out, I didn't want to be thrown back. But the eye and the eyelashes did pull me back a little bit and it was kind of upsetting. But I still love the outcome because, I mean, for my first realistic digital drawing, I think it's pretty cool. <laughs> I'm pretty excited about it. I, I like it. I actually showed it to my art teacher to get her opinion. And she loved it too. And she said that it would be great for my GCC course because they can show the video to the exam board or whatever and it would be like an extra thing that I've done and apparently that could help get me some extra marks so that's really exciting especially because this was just something extra I wanted to do by myself on the side but yeah my teacher loved it and I was so happy that she did um so yeah I I don't know I I think I like it I really do I know I have a lot of work to do on it and that it's not the best, but for my first digital art that's realistic, I think I did a pretty good job. It's, um, I did it on Ibis Paint, like all my other digital drawings. I am hoping to get Procreate, but because I've got an older version of the iPad, I haven't got the correct update to get it, so I might just settle for Procreate Pocket for the moment, which is the phone version. I, I don't know if it's good. If you guys know if it is or not, please comment down below and let me know. I tried to do the eyelash shadow there. It's, it's not perfect, but it, it's alright. It's alright. <laughs> uh, 
thank you so much for watching my video if you've watched all i am so grateful it means a lot to me uh this drawing it took me i think around nine or twelve hours to do and i didn't actually time it or anything but it seemed like that much it i did it over the course of a couple of days most of it on one day and then a few extra touch-ups the next three days and i think it was around 12 hours to be honest and i put a lot of effort into it and i really 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 do appreciate it if you watched all the way through so thank you um remember if you did enjoy to like comment subscribe and hit the notification bell if you have if you want to see when i post so yeah anyway i hope you have an amazing day an amazing week an amazing month an amazing summer <laughs> an amazing year and an amazing life just have an amazing everything <laughs> i'll see you guys next week i hope and goodbye